Okay. Let's see if it's the right. I My think. day job is a programmer. Programmer. So how many hours do you type a day? Well, at least eight and a half, and sometimes <coughs> nine, ten. So it's. And what happens? The typing is fine now. I have. I actually have a tray table, so it's my. Because um, I'm kind of short torso. Mm -hmm. um, so my. The height is okay. It's a little bit lower. Is fine. Okay. And I move back and forth like this, and I. You learned it from piano technique. Um, yes, I did. Well, partially, partially, and also from the surgeon that I saw, the doctor that. I saw. The surgeon actually recommended. What did yes. he say? That's great. He he said basically everything that you said have said. Who's that it's doctor? I would like to know who well, he is. He's retired now, Emil Pascarelli. He's Re yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but at that time, I wasn't doing much mouse work, and now yeah. it's the mouse that's really bothering me. So he did surgery on you? No. Oh, no. good. No, he no, just no, no, he no. just told he, you what to do. He rehabbed me. Okay. So I okay. could actually have no pain and get back to the piano. And stuff. Fantastic. Okay. Um, but the problem I have most is with the uh, mouse. We do so much cut and paste where we're, mm -hmm. we have to hold down the mouse and then move. Mind the way? Okay. Okay, so and what do you find? I do almost yeah. more of that than the keyboard at this point. Okay, so what, what, what happens? What's your symptoms? Oh, it feels like tendonitis. Yeah. That's what I originally had. Okay. It's just this kind of a um, scratchy feeling here and it, mm -hmm. I just get... Okay, so let's oh. see how you go to the mouse and let's see what you do. Well, it's a little bit different because yeah, you have that tray. So where's the mouse on the tray? The mouse isn't on the tray because the tray is too small. So I have okay. another little thing over here. Okay. So my, my arm is like this. So I don't have anything to rest. That's a problem. Yeah. It's like being off the table. Yeah. You know, instead of a tray, can you, can you, can, can't you have a chair that will put you lower and just have, you know, the keyboard and the mouse on a table? You know what I'm saying? Because what you're saying basically... I'd actually need... Well, wait. Why can't you... I, I need a chair. I'm just trying to think. Higher. Yeah, it's, you need it higher. higher. So what's My the problem? My chair doesn't go up that high. So you get some of this. <laughs> <laughs> I tried the idea of using my forearm. But what happens when you're like this? Are you comfortable, by the way, with you sitting now? Is it the right height for you? No. But one second. You don't go to the computer this way. You go to the computer. Yeah, like the piano. I think it's a little bit low. Let's it's put low. another one. Yeah. yeah. And I don't know even if this is enough. I'll see if I can get some music. Yeah. Sit down. Steve, and the other you. thing that I was yeah. taught was to have the tray table down a bit so that you're actually going more into like mm. this. Mm. And that makes it much more comfortable. Otherwise, I tend to be... Yeah, you have, you, we really have to control our own bodies. I mean, we don't need help. To, when we go in everyday life, it, it is, we don't have an aid to lift ourselves. We learn how to do it, you know, ourselves. Yeah, so when you go to the computer, how's that? It's still... It's still too yeah, low. Still too Chopin, low. is there? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see. No, because that's I've better, seen, yeah. that's so better. I've seen people who were, you know, who keep actually a tray that looked a little bit, you know, low to me, and I suggested to put some pillows because they, they go from office to office and, you know, they, they carry their own thing. So I, I've seen the, the opposite. Okay, how's that? That's fine. Okay, so that's what you have to set up. You work at home, you, you work in an office. Yes. Okay, you have to, that's what you have to set up. Okay. Okay, and that's not so difficult. You know, no. you get books, you get something that you keep in the office. Now, to go from there, you really need a, a, a surface to be able to rest the forearm. Okay. Yeah, try. So let's assume I have the surgery. Okay. Now, when I... Are you uncomfortable to begin with? It, I couldn't do this for very long. No, it, it feels kind of uncomfortable. One second. One minute. One minute. Can you get it very free? Yeah. Get the forearm to go there very freely. Yeah. How's that? And rest down. That feels comfortable. Yeah. But I, I feel like I'm so far forward that... Yeah, so? It's you're not used to it. No. You're so right. you get used to it, you know? Yeah. In other words, if you're here, 
That's well, too far back? Well, it's pulling you back so that you don't have the support. You need oh, a, I see. You understand? Okay. The sitting has to okay. do with being able to feel the support of the forearm behind the mouse. How's that? You should be able to, to, to sit there. How's that? Yeah. Is that more comfortable? Can you get the arm? Yeah, it's just very light resting. Mm -hmm. just, just think of doing nothing, okay? And then feel when you press down, feel that it goes all the way to here, yeah. The only question that I have, why, can I just sit for one second? One minute. It looks to me like you're very forward on it. Am I right? In other words, when I'm, where I am is that I can press down from here. So that I really, yeah, really feel behind it. Yeah, I, I, I think well, I that you, you wanted me to go that far. I don't. No, do that. no, go to where you go normally. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, this is where I normally go. Okay, are you comfortable? Yeah. Okay. And now what I have to do is I have to move this like across. Okay, go ahead. Are you moving from the forearm? Yeah. Okay, move with the forearm, and your body has to go a little bit with you, a little bit forward. Oh. oh. So you see, the body can play a big role in this I moving. Doing that. I yeah, isolated. yeah. In other words, if you sit in, can I just sit for one moment? You know, you have to. Life is about movement, right? So you really have to begin to use your logic. If you suppose, if you know that everything has to be connected and comfortable and resting down, and you're somewhere else, it's not going to happen. You know, there's no fixed position. The position is the beginning position is. You know, when we start here, but when I go here, that's what, that's what I do. My body goes a little bit forward and a little bit over to be right over here so that I can press it down and then I go back. You see, so that's why you can't just sit and relax. If you relax, you can't move. Then you relax. Sack of potatoes in one place, you know. But you have to be in a place where you can really move and adjust all the time. Small, small movements, yeah. So let's, let's go back. So while we're talking so much about this part, this part depends. Yeah, how's that? Yeah, that feels better. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. exactly. As you go over there, you s yeah, if you stay in one place, the upper arm begins to have to go there by itself. Yeah, that's it, much more comfortable. That's much yeah. more comfortable. And the forearm is always leading, right? And the upper arm then moves in very small amounts. Now, yeah. if, as far as put, pressing down, then yes. I have a hold. Is, there's no trick to that. Though. Say it again? Pressing to hold it down? down? It down. Yeah. It's, you, you can press down and hold it down and make sure that the forearm keeps it, helps keep it down. Okay. Yeah. That it's not the finger alone. Okay. How's that? So if you have to keep it down, the forearm keeps it down so the finger doesn't have to, to, to exert itself. Okay. You think that that's answering most of the questions? Practice, so. yeah. practice yeah. it and okay. see what happens. Okay. I will. But it makes sense to you? It does. Yeah. yeah. Thank and you. if you want, again, buy that DVD is selling for thirty dollars. You get an enormous amount of information. I gave it a special price, so everybody types. So if you need it, it also gives you information about the piano technique. Without knowing that, it's 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 very similar information, but we don't have the mouse. It's another sitting position, but it's the same logic. 